Is it a controversy or is it the future? As we now check in with Kizuna Ai, the VTuber royalty who this past weekend announced this. Kizuna Ai, the last live. Hello World 2022, coming February 26th. But why is this concert called The Last Live? Well, that is due to this announcement, as this talent informed us that she will be taking an indefinite hiatus after this concert, meaning there is no date yet scheduled for her return. Kizuna is now celebrating five years as a VTuber, ushering in this modern era of VTubers. But what she would say next is what would spark controversy. NFTs are highly contentious at this time, with NFT standing for, uh, something. But this is not the first time that this talent has been linked to NFTs, as Kizuna I Incorporated back on June 30th had actually made this post, that being Kizuna I Cross NFT, new project coming soon. While Kizuna I in the past has mentioned many technologies that she eventually did not take part in, many are now wondering if Kizuna I Incorporated will now move forward with this or back off of this plan due to the feedback. We would love to hear your opinions below and also please remember to like and subscribe for more VTuber news. And speaking of which, we now turn to our senior correspondent, False, for more. Good job, ID, and wow, the timing could not be more on point with Amelia Watson from Hall Live English, who this past weekend brought us into the Ametaverse. As this talent took to a 3D stream, poking and jabbing at the concept of NFTs, pointing the phrase NFAT, while also showing off her new virtual set, and announcing that we can expect a small Cali concert coming up as soon as next week. Hashtag NFAMAT then began to trend, with Hall Live English's Takanashi Kiara saying Ame is just amazing, as simple as that, leading to Null Reefer Pro to confirm that they were commissioned by Ame to implement a camera system in VR chat and also helped set up the studio map, while collaborator Seafoam Boy was back creating even more 3D assets. Mitsumini was here with this illustration, showing off a moment during the stream when Ame just randomly had lost her head, as Christina Manzanita reflected on this moment when small Ame had been drinking some water, while Sweet Bar followed up with the next result. And new members to Hall Live Japan, that being from the new 6th gen, aka Holrux, are tearing up the subscriber charts, with talent La Plus Darkness now scoring over half a million YouTube subscribers, even after YouTube had removed tens of thousands of them before. And even quicker to the punch was Sakamata Chloe, hitting the half million mark in record time, and in only half the time as the previous record holder, Galgura, also of Hololive English. Yes, Chloe is on a streak right now and loads of fan artwork is rolling in, such as this piece from Art Kuzu. 55T coming to us with this predatorial animated work. Akashi Bag having Chloe drop her mask. Akira delivering up this very expressive work. Tengu catching Chloe by surprise in this piece. Yumichio giving us a very unique and special insight into Chloe's dreams. And T6 delivering up some of that wick Donald's goodness. And congratulations are in order for Crazy Ollie of Hall Live Indonesia Gen 2, with this gen now celebrating one year with Hololive. Mia Maman was on hand with this work, giving it to the number one zombie, as Ollie had noticed that Chloe can actually blink with her mask on, leading Chloe to respond in English. Yes, and I can see my sweet honey Ollie senpai, turning Ollie, the number one Hololive superfan, into a gushing mess. And also on hand was Kanaru, the prolific 3D artist who gave us this very unique interview with Ollie out in the real world. You can even see through the glass. While 3D V artist Venji brought us this 3D rendition of Crazy Ollie's loading screen. And of course, there was a celebration for this one year event with Bobby Moonlight spearheading this effort, that being a fan video with words of encouragement 
to Ollie, which left her into a sobbing mess for 20 straight minutes. Absolutely adorable. As lastly, even one of our own moderators, that being Davidia Storm, brought us this work, saying, By the power of simping, only a true simp can weld ex Oliver. And coming up on December 8th, we have this, the Hall Live Indonesia second generation 12 hour relay involving not just Ollie, but also her gen mates, that being Anya Malfisa and Pavolia Rainey. As these three will also be taking part in Hall Live ID week, uh, coming up from December 18th to December 24th, with more details to come. And Ollie being such a fan that mere minutes before for her own anniversary. She brought us full coverage of the new Xi'an look, showing off the mismatched socks, bandage on her knee, big poofy skirt, sleeveless maid outfit, and Xi'an's new bangs, which now also come in twin tails. And while many of us could not help but notice the five head happening here, it also appears that Xi'an and her good friend Aqua have switched places, with one now becoming a maid and the other a witch. As also upcoming this week is Xion's birthday concert, bringing in such heavy hitters as Marine, Pakora, Rusia, and Akayu. And that is not even half of the announcements coming out of Hololive, as this group has also announced Hololive Super Expo 2022, and at last, the third fest, that being Hololive third fest, Link Your Wish, as these events will occur next year on March 19th and 20th. With the third fest concert taking place over two days, just as expected. And at last, at last, we had this announcement dropped on us last night. That being a teaser for the brand new Hollow Myth outfits. With the debuts of these outfits beginning later this week, we'll be certain to show you the results. And yes, Amelia, we did notice this. Congratulations, you got us. But what we don't got is the Omo Cat Cross Hollow. English collection as this merchandise collaboration dropped on December 3rd, easily becoming the biggest VTuber merchandise launch of all time and leading to Omo Cat's website to die. As numerous other VTubers such as CyberLive's Utano Pandora and Whale VTuber Bao, who is one of many independent VTubers still repping this strange red acted title, showing off here her catching a piece of this drip, drip that is making its way into fan art such as this work from Terra, along with also being seen and this are oh wait 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 this artwork from 78k6 yes this one as omo cat also announced if you order over 150 dollars of the collection you will also receive a catalog containing highlights with exclusive hollow myth interviews by omo cat themselves with the currently sold out magazine going for 15 dollars usd on its own. This artist would go on to say thank you to all of Hollow Myth. It was so fun to design and produce everyone's collections and get to know you all a bit better during the process. You're such amazing and sweet people. Really? With Omo Cat even receiving a thank you from Yago, that being the poster boy for Cover Corporation and Hall Live, doing his best with his hand placement here, showing off this Nekomata Akayu Daki. And speaking of merch, we now check in with Waifu Baby, the performance artist VTuber who scored 1.6 million streams on Spotify through the year, along with now showing off this wintry set and festive look. As merchandiser Uwu Market has officially now announced they are collabing with Waifu, announcing a merch drop for January 2022. Uwu LLC has also teamed up with other VTubers, such as friend of the show Vivi Chan the Dragon, repping her own shirts and hoodies. With Uwu Market also also announcing collaborations with Phoebe and Breakfast Burrito coming up also in January. Meanwhile, the UK panda, Shizuko, has announced this merch bundle, offering up a Daki mouse pad and charm. And speaking of charming, we now turn to Taku at Hollow Sings. Seen here announcing the closure of their YouTube channel, as this individual had been known to re-upload unarchived concerts from Hololive, while also 
taking great care to adhere to any of the asks that the talents had. All Live English's Maury Calliope would respond to this news with, I really appreciated your channel. Thanks so much for all you've done. Along with Takanashi Kiara also responding, I for one really appreciate all the clips you do. Thank you. And a very quick shout out to Carrot at Carrot VTuber, an imp artist, showing this off saying, my friends made a whole visual novel for me. I cried so much. I love them. My eyes hurt from crying. I love them. Some screenshots of parts that made me cry the most. I will cherish this gift forever. And also celebrating their birthday was Niji Sanji English talent Petra Gurren, the penguin VTuber talent that can be seen anamorphing, falling absolutely head over heels for her gender bend. And yes, we swear she is actually a part of Niji Sanji English. We swear. As this Niji Sanji English talent released a fully Japanese cover that was fully animated. That animation coming by way of Chika at 2434 Chika. With Petra going on to reply, I just wanted to thank you again for all of your hard work. Thank you for making one of my dreams of a fully illustrated music video come true. And of course we have birthday artwork such as this work from Maru with Petra at the piano. A piano that is now on fire and this work from Boreal Yauko, along with this Aurora Borealis artwork coming by way of John Wes, all at this time of year, this time of day, and localized entirely in this video, which you can now like below. And what is also liked is our co-host, Lady, inspiring this mechanical keyboard design by Silly Boy Tomato, receiving this artwork from Nolia at Nolia Tree, saying she's cute. With Lady's gift throne site, now open and you are welcome to suggest curse gifts directly to lady right now and also subscribe to her brand new youtube channel at lady vt which will be hosting all of her twitch videos and you can see more of her on twitch this thursday friday and saturday as we are also streaming every sunday tuesday and thursday right here on youtube along with new saturday streams on twitch and that is all for this episode as always, please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe below. Check out our Discord for way more VTuber news, and we'll have more things VTubers say for you soon.